Okay. <coughs> Welcome to my video for um, Beach of the Dead 6 or Beach of the Dead 2012, call it what you want. Now, let me just give you a basic rundown of my uh, zombie makeup. You've obviously got a face. I'll bring it more into light. It's kind of greyish. It's supposed to be that sort of stone grey. Sort of like some of the zombies on House of the Dead 1 and then I've done it like all up my arm sort of. All up the other arm. And the belly, which is like from House of the, inspired by House of the Dead 3. is supposed to be a uh, bullet wound. What I've done is i put like liquid latex on it and sort of ripped it up and messed it up and I've kept the stone grey thing from you know the stone grey sort of zombie skin from House of the Dead 1. What I'm gonna do is put is paste a sh load of fake blood all over this wound and this is my actual belly sticking out. You can see this little bit underneath holding the t-shirt in place which has blood all down it. So yeah, I've done my neck, I've done my face, I've done my arms, and the joke is, <laughs> I have spilt liquid latex all down my leg, so shit be whack, yo, you know, I'm gonna, um, so yeah, basically I've done my liquid latex, done my face paint, all that's left to do now is the blood, <laughs> this should be really fun. So yeah, I mean, I've just got to wait for liquid latex on my stomach to dry. And I've got, well, it's 10.43 now, so a quarter of an hour, an hour, two, three. Um, <coughs> I've got, ooh, about, uh, about three hours <laughs> for this stuff to dry. And then I've got to hit the, hit the trail, Beach of the Dead 6. It takes place uh, on, well, like, at the old... It starts at the old paddling pool down by the West Pier of Brighton. And it goes over to the Concord 2, uh, where there'll be an after party. Uh, I mean, I ain't got any money for the after party, so I think, like, when I get there, I'll just bugger off for a bit. You know, and um, fucking hell, that uh, that lens needs a good clean. So yeah, you know, I've got a few hours to just douche around, really. I'm using gel blood, like cheap gel blood. All I used this year is black face paint, white face paint liquid latex and one bottle of gel blood, like one bottle of latex, one bottle of gel blood. You know, I haven't got a whole palette of makeup in front of me like I did in previous years. But I'm still going with the theme I did last year, which is um, the zombie with the shotgun shell through the stomach. Uh, which I'll include photos of in, like, in another video, you know, I'll, uh, yeah, so, there you go, that's your basic rundown of my makeup, black and white face paint all over, liquid latex and gel blood, because it runs like real blood, and it, uh, also sticks a bit as well, just don't, do not breathe in liquid latex, I mean, if you smell it, <coughs> oh, I nearly threw up. Yikes. All right, now you can actually see me. I'm just gonna go outside <clears throat> and check the weather. Yeah, look at how gray I look. Okay, let me have a look at the weather. See what it's doing. In the trees, do 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 do. Oh, it's a terrible day out there. 
so chances are it's going to rain. This third beach would get a bid to where it's rained. Looks like the second one and third one in um yeah, Beach of the Dead 2 and 3 that were in that ran from uh, Brighton Station they uh, yeah, it rained on both occasions if it rains today well, it's predictable really so yeah, fuck a doodle Alright, so, um, I just gotta, like, I gotta leave at half one. So at one, I've gotta get my, um, fake blood on and be ready to leave for half one. <laughs> Don't know why but this thing won't focus properly. put one of my contacts in but it hurts like hell and it won't come out until later so shit I'm now ready to apply the fake blood I just need to go do that now first gotta make sure I'm packed I've gotta pack my water bottle my camera you know the rest of the fake blood it should be all good all right it's time to apply it's all right, it's time to apply the fake blood. Okay, so I've applied the fake blood. There's, you know, a bit dotted around here and there on my face. There's a little bit on my neck. What the hell, there's like a bit of pink and reddish on my arms because the main attraction is the belly. So yeah, I've got my House of the Dead 3 belly and my House of the Dead 1 skin, so it's all good. Uh, hang on, just let me check, just let me find, grab my fucking phone a sec. And I've still got 20 minutes to waste. Yeah, well, that sucks. I've just had a really stupid thought, right? Rather than wait around here, why don't I slowly walk down to um, the paddling pool by West Pier and on my way I could be filming people's reactions. LOL. You can't really make it out on this camera, but I can. Up ahead. People. Oh. <laughs> okay, I actually got a reaction out of somebody. Success! Oh, that. Oh, this guy's hilarious in the mini here. He's just staring blindly at my stomach. Smiling up oh, now. He's Oh, this is the perfect place to wait, you know, where people are driving past, they're looking. <laughs> Quick, he's gonna get us to take the dad! <laughs> oh, man, that was the most awesome reaction so far. I bet it's gonna get a lot more awesome, so I'm heading towards the beach where there's more people and more people that are just gonna look. I mean, a lot of people get the joke, you know. I'm a zombie. It's supposed to be grueling, it's supposed to be disgusting. I think, oh my god, people down there are looking at me. Sweet. Oh god, we're gonna pass them in a sec. Uh, 
Looks like they're having a bitch off. That'd be really random, just stop alongside someone's car. Uh, Alright, they laugh and they're walking off or whatever. <laughs> nice ass on that guy. There's another person up ahead. I'm going to try and not look at him and he looks like a dick. So I'm just going to leave this one out. Honest to God, I wonder how many cameras are actually going to be at this year's Beach of the Dead. Because there was that bit where it, where it went really commercial. Like in Beach of the Dead 3 and 4. But Beach of the Dead 5, I saw it like on the decline. And there's that guy looking at me, hey. <laughs> oh god, there's two, three people up ahead. Oh, this is going to get funny. Practically, my belly practically touches her face and she doesn't notice. Oh dear. Oh man. I swear. It's just getting more. Uh, oh my god, there's people up ahead. It's just getting more and more populated around here. I said. Fuck you, neighbor, fifty. <laughs> Those people just looked at me, staring blankly. There's old people in the cars next to me. Crap. And there's a woman and a child up ahead. Uh. Okay. Well, they obviously saw me and turned the other way. Well, they didn't notice. Whatever. Oh my god, there's a mailman across the road. Where's it going? I'm over here, you Ted. Get up here and look at my belly. Look at my big, red, bleeding belly. Well, since we seem to have an abundance of time, I thought I'd just stop and smell the cityscape. Yeah. Looks overpopulated down there. Sure to get a few looks. Woohoo! There's the number 50 bus up there. Heading into Churchill Square, no doubt. Um, uh, <laughs> people in cars giving me good looks. Ooh. Random people across the street, you know, just get their heads down and keep walking like, oh, it's nothing to do with us, we didn't see nothing. Oh man, shame that bus was empty, that would have been awesome. That one over there, fuck dude. Oh my god, people are looking at me from all the way down the street. Or, oh wait, no, she's just checking out the traffic. Oh my god, there's a crowd of people. This is gonna be fun on a stick. Fun on a stick. Fun on a stick, motherfucker. Oh my god, they're looking at me. They're actually looking. They see me. That's right. See me and bleed. And your eye sockets. See me and bleed out your eyes. Cheers. Oh, there's the more us. I suggest I just keep heading straight down to the beach. Turn off and head to West Pier. These people don't see a thing. Oh my god, there's a dog up ahead. I'm worried. He might just want to lick my belly. Oh man. You know what? Oh my god, pigeons, pigeons. Yeah, fuck you, pigeons. Although I've got to admit, pigeons are quite cute. Huh. Guy on the bike needs to get in the cycle lane, you kid. That's what they're there for, so fucking use them. Uh, people up behind me are looking. People up front of me are looking. Uh. 
<laughs> oh, dude, people are walking around with cameras. They're either on their way to do something or they're waiting for Beach of the Dead. I can't figure out which, but, you know, Beach of the Dead happens at three. Oh, some dude gave me a dodgy look. Ah, it's only 20 to 2. I guess I could head down through the lanes and like slowly inject myself into the horde of zombies that are heading that way. The potential horde of zombies. You know, rephrasing that there. Potential horde of zombies. We don't know if there's even going to be a horde. You know what? Maybe I should just go down there, head down through the lanes where it's more populated and where it's sexier. Actually, I'm seeing some pretty sexy chicks around it. Yeah. Or in the words of Michael Rosen, nice. Oh, man. Just filming reactions and stopping around for no reason. <laughs> Oh boy, I just saw something really awkward. It seems another building has disappeared in our fair city. Oh well. Oh god, this shit coming. Better be ready to kill the bitch. It's a bird! It's a crane! It's... Oh, wait, no. It is just a crane. Lol. Oh, he's smoking at me. It's really funny. <sighs> See, here's the thing. Even the elderly can enjoy Beach of the Dead. Here's the thing. The joke is, people actually get the idea that it's a joke. It's just for a little fun. Like back in Burgess Hill, right? I got a wolf mask as a present for finishing high school. Um, I decided to wear it into Burgess Hill. Wore it, got halfway up there. Some bitch pulling into my drive, stops right in front of me, cutting me off. And then said, oh, you know, what you do wearing a wolf mask? I said it was for a funny internet video. So she said, um, so she said, oh, well, you could scare the elderly in town. I sat there and I was like, yeah, fine, I'll take it off. Took it off as soon as she was outside, put it back on again. And that was only like two seconds later. <laughs> it's more populated. It's getting a whole lot more populated. Gonna cross the road now. There's a crowd waiting to cross the street. I have, I have one of them. I... And a zombie walking amongst humans and tourists, apparently. Yep, there's a crowd of tourists. I, I either look like part of the Blue Man group or a zombie. Like the classic ghoul, as it were. Just with his belly ripped open. Oh man, there were a couple of Asians checking me out. <laughs> hey! I fucking love the Asians. They're hilarious. Like, they actually have a good sense of humor. Unlike most of uh, England, you know, I guess the Asian culture has got to be one of the best parts of England. Uh, the acceptance of a zombie like myself in Brighton, um, you know, more to the point, the acceptance of left-wingers in Brighton, you know, like Satanists, pagans, whatever. Oh my god, there's a couple of dogs up ahead. I'm worried they might just randomly charge and lick me clean. Oh man, this is so funny. Like, 
my reaction ometer is off the scale. It's like a Geiger counter, but it's going so fast, it feels like someone's drilling into my ear hole. Like, it literally just... And so... Imagine a Geiger counter going off so much that... Uh, uh, those guys are crazy these beams on me. Whoa, that guy just backed off a bit too easily. Wow, I'm I'm pretty I'm pretty maneuverable for one of the undead. <laughs> People actually get the joke. Wow, this is amazing! See, this is what Brighton's about. Even if people don't get it, they just... Oh, there's a gay person there. Eh? I'm assuming he's gay. Or he could be metrosexual. Eh, who cares? But it's the people. Even if they don't get it, they don't become total rust cards. They just nod and laugh. And it's all good and fun. I mean, there are one or two people that don't look at you like a human being. I'm not a human now, I'm a zombie. The fuck am I talking about? <laughs> this is the ultimate joke room. Like, Hey, <laughs> oh man. Doesn't matter how old you are, beach and dead, it's still good fun, you know, it's still awesome peace and awesomeness. So I've got tourists and people and that lot of cameras taking photos of me now. See how the population escalates, so do the amount of cameras and so do the amount of reactions. Huh. What's that chef looking at? Does he work for Domino's or is he just waiting for a pizza? I'm going to thank the friends inside. Oh man. It's in an overpopulated area and I'm so embarrassed I'm actually just keeping my head down. I bet most of these people have never even heard of Beach of Dead, but what the hell? <laughs> so yeah, I'm walking past shops now. <laughs> I think I just steamed up the screen on my camera. <laughs> this is gonna be funny. I mean, I'm not even trying, and it's still hilarious. You know what, I think I've got enough footage on this street. Oh wait, no, there's a big one coming. There's a big wave of people coming. Brains. 
Mmm, hot dog. You know what? Next time, I should just get like flyers or business cards, start handing them out, get more subscribers on YouTube. I mean, of course, I'm good at picking people out, you know. <laughs> if people like what I'm selling, then, you know, if people like my image, then good for them. Oh, straight down the middle, straight in the middle. Asians. Ruffle. This is gonna get funny. Oh, uh, don't even look at me. That batch of dudes who looked at me, those are fucking awesome. people giving me dodgy looks as I walk down this wet and chewing gum covered road. Oh man, let's, let's see what happens. Walk past Cyberdog. This is gonna get mega funny. Oh, man. I'm stuck behind a horde of humans. What's the proper name for a horde of humans? I know a horde of zombies is called a horde. But what's the name for a you know for a crowd of humans? Is it a crowd? Is it an audience? Is it well, maybe it works the same way for zombies and we call them a horde. They only ever have like Oh, I should have just crept up on that kid and jumped him from behind. <laughs> Look at that dog. I really want a dog like that one day. Yeah, one day when I've got enough money to fucking feed it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yes. Even the hippies like it. Okay, I'm just going to continue on through the lanes now. Would you like a plastic? <laughs> uh, would you like a plastic? He said. I think people's sense of humor now when it's crowded. <laughs> That one was kind of like, mm -hmm. a lot of people are weirded out by me. And, oh god, my fake blood's gone all dry again. Shit, I'm gonna have to redo my blood when I get there. Here's the good thing about being like me, you know, if you're into, you know, cradle of filth, uh, based on somebody more older, cheesier horror films, you know, like I am. Like a leper. <laughs> YouTube poop this and I'll kill all you. Excuse me. Oh. Whoa. Yeah, sure. Thanks, dude. Some guy just took a photo of me. I thought it'd be really unprofessional if I had my camera out looking at him. You know, because then he'd be taking a photo of the guy holding a camera, not a zombie. You know, I just wanted to throw myself back into character for a second. A photo opportunity comes along. You know, you gotta throw yourself into character. You gotta be, you know, 
got to be posed. It's not just... He bangs into me and doesn't even notice I'm bleeding from the stomach. What a shame. Oh boy, this will be fun on a burn. Because there's people down there. Like men, women and children. Everybody's down on the beach. But it's a miserable... Ah, uh, I see my route. I go down there, round the log. And, oh, that's the West Pier in the distance. And therefore, the paddling pool where the zombies are supposed to meet. So I reckon I'll meet some of the zombies heading that way. And it will be good. We can all have a laugh. Ha <laughs> ha! Fuck you, seagulls! Lol. Oh. So yeah, I'll get some reaction footage when I'm actually on the beach. Oh my god, there's people with cameras, they're gonna take photos of me. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. We're here in the horde. You know, we are in the horde of zombies. There's the, uh, you know, leaders over there. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, real original. <laughs> I see I'm not the only one who's gone for the whole grey face thing. Oh man. Oh. 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 Come on. Oh man. Face is a wreck. Nice. Oh my god, they're actually hanging around people while they're trying to eat. <laughs> Can I take your photo? Yeah, man. Can you, can you go against it? Oh, now that is a zombie outfit right there. That's one, two, three, four of them. There's, oh god, another one with a grey face. Hmm. Oh dear. I picked, I should have stepped up my game this year. I should have spent like 20 quid on all my freaking makeup and that lot and come proper zombie fired like. Oh, no, <laughs> Oh, that one was disgusting. So, there's a whole load of humans in the middle of the zombie board. Huh? The zombie code. <laughs> Safety of both those participating in the walk and those spectating, we ask that you follow a few simple rules. Oh dear. This is where the event gets really bad. I have a feeling it's not the same organisers this year. Uh, let's see. Please listen to... Am I still recording? Cool. Please listen and respect the stewards. They're there for your safety. Fair enough. Only walk on the pavement and crossroads at crossing points designated by the event. Do not walk in the live carriageway at any time. Zombies still pay attention to traffic laws. Yeah. Beware of others trying to use the pavement to get from A to B. Don't take up the whole pavement. If you want to take photographs along the route, please be mindful of others. When you want to get a great shot, the zombie code still applies to you. It's this family friendly event, there is a strict no alcohol policy for all attendees. Any attendees see drinking will be challenged. The police have further powers to confiscate alcohol drinkers behaving in an antisocial way. 
Please stop you, be polite, whatever. Participants are asked not to enter any shops in roll. If you feel the need to do a spot of shopping, please come out of character. You can always catch up to the walk later on. Don't touch anyone. Avoid children if possible. They don't know it's fake. Yeah, actually they do. If anyone becomes aggressive towards you, do everything you can. To simply walk away and avoid confrontation. If anyone, uh, don't do anything illegal. Dressing up in a costume is not an excuse. Please leave your attitude with the living. Every year these rules are well respected and we like to repeat the fun that has been had by all, including spectators. We don't have a budget like George Romero, so please respect Brighton. Fair enough. So, now they've got laws. Huh? It's been a bad What the fuck? <laughs> 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 nice one, man. Oh god, there's a dog fight going on down there. Lol. Let's watch the dogs playing with each other for a bit. <laughs> Alright, cool. Zombies, zombies, let's see, zombies. I think I see a human over there. Oh no, wow. Oh, wow. Oh dear. <laughs> That's totally 28 days later. Well, <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, now the competition showed up. <laughs> oh man, that's hilarious. Get the kid a bit like that. <laughs> oh my god, zombie Flintstones, that is... <laughs> oh, man. They won't miss us. No, they won't. <laughs> What is he supposed to be exactly? <laughs> is he a zombie or is he like one of those guys from Manhunt? Oh great! Focus on the chips and nothing is complete without the military. Lol. <laughs> this zombie invasion would be complete without, you know, armed forces hanging around, you know, whatever. <sighs> Everybody's a bunch of dicks anyway. <laughs> I had a feeling there was a zombie in the top hat with goggles running around somewhere. And here he is. Well, fuck a luck a ding dong. It seems we're on the move.
a lot more people than there were last year and there is a lot more fucking cameras I mean wow plus I even met some old mates of mine nice okay um, so yeah There's a really cute dog over there. <laughs> what am I saying? You know what? I should do the steam again last, like next year, because it will be awesome, or oh, even more awesome, you know, because my bursary will come in and it'll all be good and life will be great. <laughs> And again, the walk has stopped. <laughs> oh, sweet! We're heading into that part of the North Lanes that I said I wasn't going to go in. I could have just turned off and went home. Hey! people off, deploying squads around the area. 
Um, I bet it's because it's like, oh, there's a large number of people, and if one of them sparks a riot, all of them are going to join in, and all of them are going to be pissed off. And they would be able to do a damn thing. It's like J Day, for example. Everybody decides to get get high, and the police don't do jack. Like you could go smoke weed in their faces, and they won't. Uh, right, an ambulance just mobilized. Don't think. Oh god, it's out of sight now. Alright, an ambulance just mobilized, so we know someone's having problems. <laughs> well, we just keep marching. For some reason, we've gone completely quiet. And yeah, we're still marching, which is good. I mean, it's long as we keep moving, you know. It's one of those, I'm just waiting for one of those moments where we will get stuck in one spot for like 10, 15 minutes and someone starts like a sort of Mexican wave. Classic corpse bride. I need a joke. It's actually a guy right there. Oh, hello. Sunday chickens. No, no. Someone just snapped the pic of me, and people are taking pictures and staring from, you know, from the road. Feds are over there. Uh huh. So they're deploying still, I take it. Or I reckon they might have finished their little deployment thing. So, well, I'm seeing some of the uh, organizers of. Um, this event down the road. <laughs> I've seen some real hotties around. Get my grip. I think. I'm still single by the end of the night. I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna pick my penis up and I'm gonna. I'm gonna slap it around a bit, you know. Maybe I should start doing what Tenacious D do, innit? Pop push ups. Lol. Of course, there isn't as great a sunset as I'd hoped because there hasn't been any sun all day. And for some reason, it's not raining. But I'm seeing storm clouds over um, in, I think, well, over in Europe, so it's going to be pissing it down over there. Just wait till it comes over here. Oh, military. <laughs> yeah. Oh, more military. No, no, they're all completely ignorant. I swear, people have calmed down way too much. I reckon it's because we lost some of the, you know, rowdy ones. I just really want to eat some brains. Real bad, I'm starving. I'm, I'm sick of eating powdered mashed potato. For crying out loud, I'm sick of... Get eating instant mash, it's disgusting. 
There's a hot rod up there, there's a, oh man. I hope it parks up nearby so then I can. Well, I'm still a long way from the Concorde, but I think I might be able to get above the Concorde. If I can get the Concorde, I can walk home without having to do with anybody. <laughs> Take the more. Secluded route, and you know. Yeah, head upwards and avoid other people. Huh. That's my plan, right there. Alright, next year I'm actually gonna go to Concord and I'm gonna um, get some featured dead merchandise. Hopefully I'll have some cash on me by then. I mean, I've got a year. Surely I'd... Well, I'll lock and shift in a year. Ah, uh, quick photo up here.